Hello everyone, welcome back to another video today. Today's video will be what if Izuku Midoriya was Undyne. Or had Undyne's powers. You guys call it whatever you want. So yeah. Izuku in this won't be starting out as you as you would usually think. Oh, and the Undying form will not be a power up. It's just something like in the actual game where there's determination. <sighs> okay, guys, shall we get in? Yes, we shall. We start off with Izuku. He has a mutation quirk that makes him look like a fish. He has sharp teeth and yeah, blue skin. And red hair. Izuku is not like everyone else. While everyone is playing a hero, he, he practices fighting. Even with his best friend Bakugo. Or as he calls him, Kachan. Izuku always had the intention to win a battle and fight to the end. He always just wanted to be like his number one hero, All Might. Izuku always liked to train. It was even more special when he got his quirk. The first time he got his quirk. The day he wanted to start training. That day was his fourth birthday when he discovered that he had a quirk, an energy construct type of quirk, but, the, but there seemed to be something else within it. Suga did not think of it much and pronounced that the name will be Spear of Justice. Inko smiled as she looks a lot like her son. But this time had had green, but had, but her hair was green as well as all the fins on her. Izuku was put in several martial arts and aced a lot of them. They even compared him to a, a great white, and he can actually be underwater for. A, a, great amount of time. The longest he has ever been was spending was spending around two weeks underwater training until he started running of, of oxygen. So yeah. Izuku always has been the one to stop Bako from bullying people, saying he will fight him if he if Bako doesn't stop. And Bako didn't care, always pushing Izuku around to the point he was Bako was even able to actually manipulate Izuku into attacking people. As Izuku always had a list of people with dangerous quirks. So when Bako said that, when Bako started an argument and got the guy, person with a dangerous quirk to start fighting someone out of defense, he tells Izuku what's going on, and Izuku battles and wins the fight. This causes Izuku to not have much friends. But, whereas he did not have friends, he was able to get, make them. He met, he met two guys named Reggie. So, 
he called him Reggie 1 and Reggie 2. Sorry for the loudness of the fire truck, guys! <sighs> Sorry about that, guys. Fire trucks can be really loud. Now, where was I? Oh, yeah. Izuku also met friends who who were actual animals with quirks. Four of them. What was it for? Hmm. I don't know. So, yeah. The, the nine-year-old Izuku decided to make a front. A united front for all villainy. Calling it the Royal Guard. When asked why, he said that knights are cool. And the people who actually looked up to Izuku, mainly his, his friends, actually agreed with this. So, they start, Izuku, they all started training. Early on, and always trained in the forest. Mainly do manhunts and everything. Izuku loved actually doing this. As he's actually is this helps him a lot. So yeah. Izuku is talking to one of his friends when When a villain attacks them. <laughs> so, what are you kids doing here? <sighs> Leave them alone. We are the Royal Guard, and we'll stop you. <sighs> the villain grabbed the friend that he knocked down. And this stopped Izuku from attacking, as... He don't want to, the guy to hurt his friend. Izuku, Izuku heard that he, the others were about to attack when Izuku raised his hand, ordered him, ordering them not to, as Izuku was their captain. Let my friend go. We will do whatever you want. It's your girl. You can do it. I'll walk it off. This stupid friendship shit. It's starting to piss me off. The guy was holding the... One of Izuku's dog like friends by the. was holding him by the legs and slammed him into the brick wall. Izuku then shot a spear at. Is, not shot. thrown a spear at the villain. Yeah! Take that! The blue, the blue energy spear stuck into the villain. As Izuku made, as Izuku conjured another one. So, is that all you got? Izuku started throwing more spears at them. As Izuku was trying to hold the front with his friends. Wanting to make sure that none of them get hurt before him. Izuku kept on fighting until a pro hero arrived. Hey! Oh, shit! Ah. He's about to leave when Izuku, when Izuku grabbed a rock 
and thrown it at him. Then through a dumpster. What the hell? Do you have some of our strength? Fuck. Shit. The pro hero then held up his hand as Izuku was about to throw another object at the villain. Izuku sir ran to his friend who had who was unconscious. An ambulance arrived and his friend was pronounced alive, but he will have some seeing issues. Meaning he won't be able to see anything that does not move. Izuku just felt bad for this. If he had, if he wasn't, if he was stronger, he would have defeated the villain. Soon, Izuku and the friends were able to visit. He were able to visit him in the hospital. Wait a minute, guys. Izuku walked into the room as is as Izuku's canine unit followed, which is what Izuku called the unit that basically were dogs. Taco, are you okay? What are you talking about? I'm okay. My eyes low. So, give it to me straight, Captain. What did he say? You won't be able to see anything that does not move. It's seeing problems. They damaged your eyes. But, hey. You can still fight. We just had to hide in your hearing. Yeah. Hide in your hearing smell. Then you will be all right. <laughs> yeah. Our little battle royale would help me out. Your parents should be discharging you soon. So we'll... So, we'll, have, we'll be able to have a battle royale in the forest again. Can you bring pizza? And some dog biscuits? I, I still don't understand why you guys like that. Yeah, you haven't tried something. You haven't tried the deliciousness that is dog biscuits. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, how's the others? Well, lesser dog and greater dog are doing okay. The mech, the mecha suits that greater dog is ma was making, is actually working good. I'm actually surprised on how technology could help in battle. Oh yeah, you're always about the old ways are better and cooler, and anime rules. Is it good then chopped the back of his neck? The front of his neck, taking the air out of him. <laughs> so, I'm sorry. That's what you get from me, an asshole. That's all. Me and Gray, me and Lesser Dog are. Me and Lesser Dog are just having a good time. We're able to actually learn new tricks. I'm actually, I was able to make a shield out of the energy that my soul creates. Huh? Really? It's cool. Yeah. I mean, it's green, so... It's green. It's... I'm able to actually block a lot of you guys' attacks now. So... 
So, I'll be your spirit shield for now on. What about Dog and me and Dog Ressa? Are those two? Oh. They're good. Have you confessed yet? No. What about her? Nope. We still need to get those two to admit to each other. I don't know. It would be really funny. Yeah. Yeah. It would. <laughs> we would get to tease them all the time about it. Yeah. Anyways. I brought I brought you some flowers. My mom said it would be it would be good. Thanks for moving a lot for me. I'm able to actually see you. <laughs> yeah. Anyways. The doctor just said that you won't that you only to see when things actually move. Not like if you're not, but the limits to that are facial expressions. Facial expressions if someone were standing still. But if someone were moving their arm or arms or walking, you'd be able to see them. But you won't be able to see anything you're doing yourself. That's why we need to heighten your sense of smell and hearing. <sighs> okay. <sighs> okay, let's do this. A month later, Doggo was able to, was getting, was 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 now out of hospital. They were able to get him by pleading over Izuku and the and the rest of his friends. Bako is not in his group anymore. Izuku is. Nervous now. The thought of losing his friend just hurts him. They had a battle royale again. They even they had a battle royale again. As and. The battle royal was basically targeting Daga to help him move, to help him learn new feats, the new abilities he needs to learn. Extra good hearing and extra good smell. Izuku always now started throwing boulders at Daga. And Dog was actually able to see the boulders coming out of So instead they decided to put a blindfold on him. And after a year, they were able to actually get him back in fighting shape. We're lying on a meth on mantis style kung fu as well as other things. They and they didn't care if Doug, if he was half blind now. They were they were his friends. Izuku was now thirteen and standing on a rock. As his okay, let's see. Doggo, doggo, you know. God damn, there's so many of them. Basically, all of them are just. standing around him. As Izuku awards dog tags to the new. the. the dog. the canine unit. As all his friends cheered, as they have not won, they have not lost a single battle royale.
in the year that they've been training Doggo. The years they've been training Doggo, and as well as the fact that all of them together made almost an unstoppable force. Izuku grabbed some pizza boxes and threw it, them around. As people just started jumping to grab pieces of food. So that was that, guys. So yeah, they kept on grabbing the pizzas, pizza boxes as they, as they ate. And everyone celebrated the, for the dog unit. The canine unit for their... For their... Just overall achievement. So, yeah. I, Izuku was down in the forest as he was hunting down the dog unit. The canine unit. Throwing spears at them. And overall, just trying to, just trying to be a badass at everything he does. Soon, Izuku got to the center point, the middle of the forest, which was a single, the biggest tree there, and touched it, winning the game. Izuku just smiled. As he laughs in victory, he helps his the he helps Doggo up who who was close to actually getting him. As their soldiers, as the soldier units ran to them and applaud. That's going to be it for part one, guys. So it's like, comment, and subscribe, and wait, what, what's that? Izuku's at a waterfall as he sees a girl below. Who is it? Who knows? And that's going to be it for today, guys. So it's like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.